We are in a state of fiscal and economic urgency. Working hours have been reduced, salaries cut, and thousands of our people have lost their jobs altogether. As of today, the Bureau of Budget and Management Research has reduced the budget allotments to Guam Community College, the University of Guam, the judicial branch, and even this legislature. Our public schools will not be where we would like them to be either. It will be difficult just to maintain an adequate public health delivery system and to provide our children with even the basic tools to learn. The long-term systemic problems surrounding Guam Memorial Hospital will not be solved by the time I leave office. Thousands of our most vulnerable citizens were already faced with reductions in welfare benefits. Hundreds more are going to be forced off the welfare rolls entirely. The latest census shows that 25% of our population is below the poverty line and they hardly pay any income taxes at all. I am proposing that this body seriously consider raising our gross receipts tax from the current 4% level to 6%. That is why I am again proposing a 10% across the board salary reduction for all three branches of this government. Every classified and unclassified employee, I have asked the Civil Service Commission to review and adjust pay scales downward for all other government executive branch employees.